And I want to go for a dwarf build. I want to go for a proper treant build right from the get-go. Because we didn't quite go treant early. I'm trying to think of what else. The other thing I would say is I'm actually kind of mixed on fighting real people. If only because of the timers. Uh, it's a little slower. Double the abilities here. Two, level 2 and 3 treasures. That's really good. Summon a character, character during a brawl. Give it 2-2. Two, two. Oh, during a brawl. Find a treasure, give your characters permanently, or front row... Sad Dracula... is not terrible. I want to buy Sad, Sad Dracula. He's probably bad, but I love the idea of that permanent... permanent bonus. Especially if I can get boosted slay bonuses, because I know there's a number of characters that do. Uh, let's see... Okay, I'm just gonna buy the chicken. I don't know if the chicken's good. I wonder what the upgraded version of the chicken is. And why is Dracula sad? I don't know. So yeah, do you just have sad Dracula unlocked permanently now? Yes. So, upgraded sells for four. That doesn't strike me as necessary. Ah, uh, we don't get it. Okay. Princess Mage, quest cast four spells. Cat. And we're just gonna boost the cat. There is Mad Mim. Probably should have boosted something else, but I don't know. I'll think about this. I might end up watching Rhapsody play this for a little while, just to really get a read. Oof. Oh, that's a bad start. Yeah, Princess br build. I could go for a Prince and Princess build. It's an option. Okay, I'm going to buy that. Transform the unicorn into another cat. And then we'll just go boosted cats. I guess this works out. Yeah, watching other people play is probably the best way to learn how things work. I mean, frankly, the best way to, in my opinion, the best way to learn is just by playing. Am I going to do well? No. Am I going to win every time? No. Am I going to win that often? No. But I'm going to learn. Now, unfortunately, my cats are not the toughest thing in existence. Also, holy shit, that gnome. And these mages. How is he, how is he getting such tanky dudes? Okay, what do we have? Dwarf support. The donkey. Good princess. Adventure. Slay 1A XP. What else do we have? Slay plus 4 health this brawl. Tempting. Tempting. But I'm not. If I could get her to actually be good, that could work really well for me. I just have to wait and hope maybe we get a cat or Cinderella. I mean, maxing out Cinderella will be kind of nice for a, a cheap artifact. That helps. Now, do my characters have to survive to get the slay bonus? I don't know. Ripes, queen, queen of Hearts hurts. Everything hurts. If I can get a, another Mad Mim.
Okay, what do we get? Treants are have plus three attack and are evil. And all of these are kind of okay. I think we're gonna go fairy tale just because I'm probably not going treants on this round. There we go. And she's not she's okay. I'll probably get rid of her, but we'll see. I have nothing else to do. Okay, don't need to survive, but they can only slay they can slay only on their attack. Oh, got it, got it. Wow, this person's actually Oh, grandmother, start with fifty health. When you reach level six, become big bad wolf. Oh. My mad mim. How dare. Hey, she gets the bonus. Unfortunately, we don't have a slay... Well, I mean, we gain EXP, but we don't have a slay gain max HP as well. Gosh, that would work out really well for me. Okay, I'm gonna grab this. Support, plus five attack. When I attack, give the characters behind me plus three three this brawl. Huh. That's pretty good. Give the character plus three attack permanently. That sounds fun. Reroll, see if I get anything amazing. There is... So there's Queen of Hearts, which is good. There's also the Blessing of Athena. I'm gonna probably live without it. Can't cast anything else anyway. I guess it doesn't really matter. I'm gonna try and guarantee she gets the kill. I'm mix mixed on the Vainpire. Whoa, Krampus. The shit does Krampus do? Evil characters have 1-1. One, one. Makes sense. Damn it. Oh, this went bad. Do we just concede? Nah, I'm gonna hold on for as long as possible, whether or not it's a good idea. Uh, let's see. When one of your dwarves dies, press buy seven dwarves. Cripes. She seems fun. Broccoli. When I survive damage, gain 10 attack this brawl. I don't really like any of these. Oh, we can upgrade the cat. So that helps. Gain gold. Start of the brawl. Start of each brawl, give one of your characters plus 4-4. Four, four. I guess I'm going to go Jack's Jumping Beans just because what else? what the heck else do I get? Gonna grab her just to give these two some health. Yeah. Cinderella's not really good. I'll just ignore her. Character 3 3, this brawl. Let's boost her up. Vampire is considered not great. He usually dies when he slays. So his slay trigger is wasted. That makes sense. I love the idea of a slay-based build, because he, fe he feels like he'd work really well with that. Yeah, unfortunately, we're not great on the whole survival business. Okay, that gets me one slay. That, that doesn't count. I think she'll get another chance, if we're lucky. There we go. Let's see. Treant plus six health permanently. Nah. And I could get a pair of crafties.
They rank as a potential. Okay, what do we want? Characters have plus one attack, gold every round. Gold carries over to the next round. Ooh. I'm just going to do that. Not that it's immediately going to help me here. And do we want to sell both of these crafties for the gingerbread party? I think I'm going to say no, it's probably a mistake. Actually, screw the Vainpire. Get him out of here. He actually works better without Vain characters. It makes sense. Or, not Vain, Slay characters. No, that, that makes total sense, actually. That yeah, beefy crafties. Especially if we can get the uh, upgraded version. I don't think I'm going to keep him around as a mainstay, but who knows. Yeah, we want her to stay there. Rude. Wait, why? No. Oh. Ow. bad. Ouch. Extra health permanently. Heck yeah. Okay. Other dwarves have 2-2. Two, two. Bossy. Slay. I mean, Chupacabra is pretty solid. I want to go Medusa. Move away from the cat. The main question is, who attacks first in these situations? I don't fully know. Probably an issue for me. Guess I could have waited there. Oh well. It's fine. Yeah, you know what? I'm gonna move her back. I'm just gonna move away from the adventurers. I don't think they're as good. They might have been good early on, but nowadays, less so. Cripes. Gwen has not taken any damage. I am up against somebody that is actually good at this game. This does not surprise me. I just realized that Mrs. Claus has a gun. Whoa, Good Witch of the North is way better than I thought it was. Well, it's fine. I lose. But that's, that's okay. We'll give it another shot. I think so much of my so much of my problems revolve around the fact that I don't quite know the good combos right off the bat, and I think as I figure them out, I'll have a much easier time of this. Might end up buying some gem gems just so I can, you know what? Do I want to do that store? How much is it for gems? How many heroes are there? What is what are even these? Oof, that's expensive. It's the early access pack. Pricey. I guess I'll buy this at the very least. One hundred and twenty bucks is a little steep for me, but I could buy three characters. So if if those of you that actually know this game. Uh, want to just shout when, like, a S tier character goes by? I would not mind picking up... There we go. Uh, picking them up and actually using them. So, Hearthstone Battlegrounds, but a, uh, a card-based auto-brawler? Yes. Which is solid. 
Oh, that's an ugly looking chest. Whatever it does, I don't know what it does. I think this is actually going to be kind of perfect for me. I've been looking for something that I can stream for fun. And just kind of kick back with. And, uh... Hello. If you're, you cast a spell directly on a character, give it 2-2. Two, two. Cast a random spell every round. Uh, let's see. Avella. When one of your animals dies, give your evil characters 1-1 one, one this brawl or summon a character during a brawl. Avella is S-tier. Well, she's not... I mean, I'll grab her. Yeah, I can't buy her, but I'll roll her. She seems pretty solid. But yeah, I've been I've been kind of directionless on what I want to stream lately. Uh, largely because I've been doing a lot of, well, most games that I play beyond, like, the first day or two are usually long story-based games, which I don't really enjoy streaming as much. Oh, let's see. Bad Billy Gro Groff. We have the Kitty Cut Purse. I mean, I should go with this guy. He just fits too well. She makes cats kind of in insane. I can imagine. I'll go with Bad Billy Gruff. Kitty Cut. First seems like I could... If I could succeed with him, it would work out. But chances are he'd just get gibbed, so I'm not going to think about it. Rolling Econ in these games rarely works out in my favor. Wow. I thought it was starting... Ooh. Evil monster. Animal mage. Do I want to go with Labyrinth Minotaur, or do I want to go with the Wizard's Familiar? I probably want to go with the... with the Minotaur. I'll buff him. Put it on the bottom row. Got it. Damn it. I... I, I go tree, but it doesn't really work. God, it's tempting, though. Okay. What else do we have? More tree? Um, I'm just gonna grab the Cinderella. Not that she's actually any good, but it's extra firepower for the time being. None of these guys were evil anyway. I really want to go for a dwarf build someday, but... Okay, I still lose, but I don't lose by much. Okay, there's the Brave Princess. Wormroot. Wormroot is good. Okay, we're gonna grab those, and I'm gonna buff him. Wormroot worked out great. This worked out really well. I'm gonna move him to the back corner. And I'm gonna move the Kitty Cat Cup Purses back a little bit further. This is a weird build, but it's working. Yeah, so I'm, I'm gonna wanna have just a, a sacrificial line of evil animals along the bottom, and then something useful elsewhere. Something strong. I know the good witch would be maybe kind of good. Especially if I could make her evil. Wait for someone to spawn with a princess only build. I could see it happening. Frankly. There we go. Alright, what do we got? Trash. Nah. 
Blind mice. Range. When one of your characters triggers a slay ability, gain 1-1. One, one. I... I mean, they're an evil monster. They're not terrible. Let's see if we get something useful. Oh. We end up with the Brave Princess. It was not really good, so I'm going to get rid of her. A good witch of the north would be great. Mostly I just want to... I want to finish this quest. I'm mixed on the Shadow Assassin, but it works well with this whole evil build. And yeah, if these guys can even just do a little bit of damage, we'll be good. Queen of Hearts, level 3, or Vulture, level 4, are your friends in this build. Okay. Now, can you upgrade a unit beyond the first level? Or is there no, like, third tier? Yeah, we got this. Yeah, only one upgrade. Perfect. That's all I really need to know. We have a monster. Ugh. We three permanently. Yeah, that's the stuff. Let me grab that. Just go evil support. Let's see. I'm going to move her over here, because I, I really want to focus on those kitty cat cup purses. Animal. Okay, so there's the Wicked Witch of the West versus Good Witch of the North. I see how it works. Okay, and there's another one of these. Do we lock? I'll lock. I don't want to be turning anybody... You know, how much do I care about the Shadow Assassin in retrospect? I guess I care a bit. Cut purses should go first with the support underneath them. Okay. So I was thinking of putting them later so that they could, um... They could get the bonuses from the bad billy goats. I've gotten really lucky with those worm roots. That's a decked out cat. I think I, I win though. Just barely, but I do win. Okay, buy that. There's a black cat. Our character gained gold. Chupacabra, too. I don't actually know if the Chupacabra is good. I'm just gonna eat the cat. Alright, she levels up. Dragons have 5-5. Five five. When you buy an evil character, give it 5-5 five five this brawl. Or just fairy tale. I don't really like most of those, to be honest. I'll grab the Chupacabra. It's better than the Minotaur anyway. Is it? I don't actually know if it is. I'm gonna leave the Shadow Assassins off. Hmm, that's tough. Because I love the idea of the Chupacabra scaling up pretty quick. If I can get it. Hey, th thank you, Leon Harth. For the three-month resub. Let's see, and thank you, Exynos, for the 24-month resub. Happy birthday, but to you or me, definitely you. I'm pretty sure. Oh, the princess. Oh, yeah. But why, why sell her now? Why not sell her on the next round? 
Ah, whatever. Too late now. Okay. He did get the stats. Unfortunately, they have a pair of Queen of Hearts. It's like I'm facing the build that I want. Last breath, summon a sheep. Give characters in the front. Ooh, good princess. Not interested. Oh no, I guess I do carry over a little bit of the gold. Okay. Start a favorite ball. No, dancing sword? I guess I'll just do dancing sword. Okay, and there's the cat. Uh, let's see. I don't care about most of these. That copy of the first enemy character that dies this brawl. Another evil mage with a support copycat. Trigger the la last breath. Now kidnap sounds kind of interesting. I'm going to reroll though. There's got to be something better. Three health permanently. I'll take it. Okay. I'm just going to boost the Chupacabra at 12 seconds. Okay, get that, get that, switch with Cat. Whew. Some of these other characters would be good too, but we'll see how this works. Oh, no carryover gold. Got extra from slaying the cup purse. Oof. That's dead, but we get another one. Chupacabra gets a kill. Yeah, these two uh, kind of scale off of each other really well. That's what I was looking for. Okay. Gold, take damage. Nah. If we get lucky. We get a worm root. We also get a Queen of Hearts. Um. Boost him. I'm gonna sell the Minotaurs. We're gonna grab the Queen of Hearts. And do that, I think. I'm mixed on the Wicked Witch. But this seems like my best option. Because that way she gets tanked out. She gets hella tanked out. Unless she j just gets killed by a ranged character. It's possible. Just re-roll. We don't need that. I don't think we need any of these. I love monster manual. Whenever your, one of your monsters dies, gives it give it plus two attack. That's gonna make the chupacabra real spooky. Okay. Barely win. But I'm getting there. Okay, I don't think I want any of these. Chupacabra. Shoot. Which we want. I'm going to sell the cat. It's not as good. gonna buy that at this point oh and we're full up so I guess that didn't help me it's fine burn a reroll see if I get anything else the answer is no the other option is 
I'm just going to get a second, my second Queen of Hearts. At this point, the extra support in the Kitty Cut Purse and the Black Cat is not that helpful. If I can get that upgraded, then it'll be helpful. But unless I get that, we're kind of stuck. I might want to start rolling for the good stuff. Whew. They're tanky. Now... I might not actually survive this one. This guy is tough. Cripes. Ow. We need two up copies to upgrade. Okay, there's the Chupacabra. Oh, but I gotta get rid of something to fit it in. That kind of sucks. Well, do we just get rid of the cat? Wait, I don't? How do, how do I get it then? Oh, there we go. Buy a spell that costs her less. It's played twice. So level two or three characters are upgraded. Um, it's going to go for the Gilded Harp, and we're going to switch up the Dancing Sword. I don't actually know if that's really that good of an idea. Let's see. I'm just going to grab that, whether or not it's a good idea. Well, at least we end up with a tanky as hell chupacabra, at the very least. But, uh, he ends up with that. Shit. I was like, eh, my chupacabra might be okay. No, we lose. Like, how the hell do you even get over that? At least it didn't insta-give me, but, um... Oh. It's just upgraded. Well, that backfired. That backfired badly. Let's see. Give the monster a bonus. I guess we'll just give it to him. He needs to live. Go for the evil support. Let's see. Can't cast any more spells. I'm just going to keep rolling in hopes of finding... An upgrade for one of my dudes. I guess I can sell these. Because I'm never going to get another one. Ah, uh, I never... Another upgraded one. I'm going to... Hail Mary. We're going to lose, probably. Oh, god damn. What the hell even happened? Like, I thought my Chupacabra would be a powerhouse, and the answer is no. I was wrong. How do you even deal with that kind of business? How does that even happen? Oh, yeah, that would, that would do it. That would do it, wouldn't it? <laughs> oh, boy. All right, we're going to keep rolling this. This is really fun.